Okay, so what is up everybody on YouTube? This is once again your guy, Super Gaming HD, and we're back in Farmers Mode 2017 right here. We're back in the American Outback map that you actually have seen me play in some times, but I thought that it was actually time to play in it again. It's been some time since we played in it last time, so right now we're gonna go ahead and play it again. And this is of course my beautiful house right here. And as you know, I found all the golden nuggets and uh, it was pretty easy to actually find everything because there were only like one golden nugget and it was placed down at the valley grains close to the burnt down church that is actually down there so uh, so yeah that's pretty cool uh, I got one million out of that only one golden nugget one million that's pretty easy so I bought some new equipment you guys also know that I bought like the new plow, the new case I hate Puma right here, and also the new Holland CR 1090, and of course also our most favorite uh, kind of like wagon right here with the oversized load sign on. So the reason why I only bought like one truck with wagon on right here, or kind of like with only one wagon on, was basically because I know that this truck cannot pull any more than just this one wagon. At least not uphill, actually. But uh, I know that the 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 kind of like uh, the structure on this map right here is not uphill at all. So maybe I can actually go ahead and pull two wagons on this map right here. But um, yeah, we're gonna check that out later because right now I don't really need that. I just need everything to actually be everything up and down because I want everything to be done 100% correctly and the next thing that I'm gonna go ahead and buy is actually a cedar because I need a cedar so that I can seed some more crops so that we can get some more money and another thing that I want to buy in this map right here is basically sheep because with the sheep I can make wool you guys know that from the Drumod farms and I can make a lot of money and that is exactly what we want to do. We want to make someone money, so much money that we can actually be uh, kind of like insolvent and actually kind of get everything that we want in the game without cheating. So I decided that to myself, I'm not going to use any money cheat box in this map right here. And I hope it is indeed okay with you guys because that is making the game a little bit more realistic, I guess. So uh, yeah, let's go ahead and do this. Let's change over to the big Kaisai H Puma that I have right here. And you know, you guys know that I'm actually currently kind of like uh, trying to uh, make a new field down here. And that is exactly what we're going to continue doing. So let's get up and actually do this. This is a free field, totally free, because there were nothing down here. This is literally not a field. So this is 100% free. And what I actually want to kind of see if that when we're going to seed this, can we actually go ahead and hire a worker to seed this field? That is, that's going to be kind of like real special to actually check out. Because I don't think so. It, it probably have to be a legit field to actually go ahead and seed it with the hire worker option. So uh, yeah, we're going to find out later on, I guess. So far so good. We're just going to go ahead and do this like this as we do right here. And uh, everything is looking like real good at the moment. So, uh, so that is exactly what we wanted to do. Du -du -du. Just like this. Have to make sure to actually get everything with us. And uh, it's pretty good right now because I can just kind of turn around without having to stop. I can just go like straight ahead. Uh, so uh, yeah, that's like real good. So uh, yeah. And uh, then we're gonna go like straight this way. that so you can see that we're only missing like the middle part right here 
So it's basically not that much that we're actually missing. It's just kind of like this little piece right here that we're missing. So uh, we're going to take that and we're going to see if we can actually kind of get everything up running like 100% cool right here. That would be pretty, pretty good if we could do that. So, uh, so yeah, let's get this in just like this. And then we're gonna go down this way. Like little little rally. Literally. Just like this. Cutting like more not cutting. What am I talking about? Oh, I know it. I know what we're actually gonna seed in this. We're gonna seed. Yeah, that is exactly what we're gonna go ahead and actually seed. We're gonna seed grass for the sheep. You know? We're gonna go ahead and seed some grass for the sheep in this field right here. That would be, oh my god, that is cool. That is exactly what we're gonna go ahead and do. But I just think, is this not grass already? Or what is this actually? Is this not grass? Hmm, eh? I'm not quite sure. I'm not quite sure if this is actually already grass that we have right here. But I think it is. We're gonna find out later on. First of all, I need to plow it. Also, I'm just gonna plow it and then we're gonna see if this is actually grass already. Uh, definitely, it, it's definitely gonna be exciting to actually see if it is that. So, uh, yeah, gonna cut some more. Just like this. Let's back it up a little bit. Let's get down here. And then we're gonna go like straight down here, yes sir. And that is exactly going good. Dun, dun, dun. Dun, 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 dun. Just like this. And yeah, so we got it right there as you can see. We're gonna turn around right here and get down to the other side of course. So we're gonna drive like this way. Cut some more. Okay, so Hilbo Eye has actually completed that task. That is basically the harvest down here. So maybe we should go ahead and empty that guy. I actually think that. So uh, we're gonna go ahead and empty that. And then I think that we have to go ahead and buy cedar, basically. Because I want to check, uh, I actually want to check out the stuff with the grass. Uh, but there is only one issue because when I actually have to uh, when I buy a cedar I can't use my case I hate pruner since it's gonna run with the new cedar that I actually gonna buy so uh, yeah I'm just gonna think about that a little bit but right now we're gonna go down and actually empty this harvester right here I guess so let's empty it Just like that. Yeah, so now we're done with this harvest right here. I'm just gonna kind of drive over with this load and sell it. So uh, we're gonna go down to the old grain store. That is the place where I wanna sell this load right here. So let's take over that little car right there. It's not that big. And then just kind of go full throttle down to the old grain store. Uh, yeah. Yeah, uh-huh. You know what it is. Black and yellow. 
So uh, the old grain store is down here, so you can see the green building down there and the silos, so you can see everything. So that is the place where we're going to go ahead and actually sell this right here, guys. Let's see how much money we're going to get out of this. We have like 17,655 kilos or liters in the, in the wagon right now. So it is basically not that much that we have in the wagon. But we're going to see if it is actually enough to kind of pull everything with. It would be pretty cool if it were. So we're just going to do like that. Uh, we're not going to make that much. Like literally not. Uh, only kind of like um, 12,000 that's not a good price like definitely not a good price but this is actually the place where I sold this and uh, this is the equipment that I used so I'm probably gonna end this video right now I hope that you guys enjoyed it so please go ahead and give this video a big thumbs up if you did and also make sure to subscribe to the channel if you haven't already done it I gotta say that when we hit 10k on, this, on the channel right here I'm gonna do a big giveaway also, I'm going to launch the multiplayer session with you guys when we hit 10k. So that is definitely something to look forward to. So yeah, bye.